Officer Andrew Delkey and Daniel Hambrick crossed paths for the first time on July 26, 2018. But only one of these men would walk away alive. The fatal encounter began on the streets of North Nashville. Officer Delkey was on patrol searching for a stolen vehicle. At some point, while Hambrick pulled inside an apartment complex and took off, allegedly armed with a gun, surveillance video shows the men, both 25 years old at the time, in a full sprint. They round a corner, and then you see Officer Delkey stop, plant his feet, and fire at Hambrick as he runs away. Hambrick falls and never gets back up. According to reports, Hambrick was hit three times, twice in the back and once in the back of the head. City officials forced to respond as community outcry intensified. My role is to make sure that on the front end, we are doing the absolute best we can as a community when it comes to policing. The district attorney releasing video of the shooting, hoping its bid to be transparent will build trust with the black community. The police officer fired four times, three of those bullets rip Daniel apart. But the move is a little solace for Hambrick's grieving family. My daughter is now thinking that the police is the enemy. According to a warrant, Officer Delkey said he saw Hambrick holding a gun and that Hambrick didn't comply with verbal commands. Despite his claims, prosecutors filed charges shortly after the release of the video. Hambrick's family faced Delkey during a pretrial hearing. Defense attorneys suggesting Delkey was simply following police practice from the moment he squared his feet and pulled the trigger. He's doing what he's taught to do, that um, this is the most serious thing the police do. If they have to use deadly force, they want to hit what they're aiming at. But the prosecution countered, questioning the witness about Delkey's decision to use deadly force. You're in agreement with me that that was the decision that he made. I'm, I'm in agreement he made the decision because the subject had a gun in his hand and wouldn't follow directions to put it down. The judge ruled the case should go to a grand jury. Mr. Delkey, is there anything you want to say to the family? And in January 2019, Officer Andrew Delkey was indicted for first-degree murder. Her son is gone for no, um, no reason. For now, Officer Andrew Delkey remains decommissioned, free on bond, and facing the possibility of life behind bars if he's convicted. Okay, let's take a look. We've got a trial date, folks. This summer, July 12th. July 12th, Tennessee versus Andrew Delkey. Uh, we'll continue to give you updates as we get closer and closer to that trial date.